my channel. Today I'm going to be sharing with you five easy ways to make your days a little bit better. I'm sharing this with you because I've needed it. We're in the middle of the winter here in the Midwest. It's freezing outside. It's always overcast, hence the lighting. You know, that's just what I have to do in the winter. But I just, I've been stuck in this survival mode for I don't know how long. And I've been in need of, and I've been testing these out, simple, easy, tangible ways to feel like I'm thriving rather than just surviving 24 seven. So I'm gonna share these with you. Again, I've been testing them since like mid-December because I wanted them to be real and practical and helpful for you. So let me take you through just a few things that I do every day to help myself jump on the happy train. <laughs> yeah, that's it's just been needed in this season of life. So let's go. We have the morning too. Okay, here's what the morning too is. It is not a morning routine. I've said this before, I've actually showed you my morning routine, but I feel like it's just not realistic for me anymore to have this pressure to do the same huge list of things every single day and not expect change. I feel like when things did change, I would just get a little flustered, even with my super simple routine. So this is just not a routine. It's just the morning too. That's all. It's clear, simple, it's precise. Here are the two things that I do every morning just to give myself the sense of this, ah, She's doing what she normally does. This is safe. This is controlled. This is a controlled environment. It's just, it's just what I need right now, okay? This is my calendar, and it also has space for little journal entries in it too. This is new for me, this big calendar thing, but it's really been working. If I can find one for you, I'll link it because this is the best calendar that I have purchased in a while. And then the other thing is my cozy, red light therapy. I do them together. I sit in front of the red light, preferably just bare skin because that's the most effective, but it boosts your energy. It supports your skin health. It does so many things, so many healthy things for your mitochondria, for your cells. That's why I just do this every single day. I also heard that it supports you in the winter when you're not getting as much sunshine. It's just a really healthy light and frequency. So I'm trying to get like all the good biohacking good, good stuff done with my red light therapy. And then this is for my brain. I feel like if I do that, things are fine. Things are a little bit less chaotic. I can't control the rest of the day, but at least I can do my morning too, right? Just easy morning too. Number two, super simple, but always makes my day, always makes me feel stronger but it's when I eat a lot of protein for breakfast. I always have to have a carbohydrate with it to balance, otherwise I feel a little too groggy. I need that energy from the carbohydrates, but I have to have protein, otherwise I'm really hungry really fast, and I have crazy sugar cravings, I'm grouchy, I'm irritable. Protein is the way to go in the morning. So a few ways to get some extra protein in to my breakfast and my children's breakfast is just doubling up on my eggs. For some reason, I lived in this belief that two eggs is enough. Any more than two eggs and I'm overeating. I don't know where I got that and I, I know that's not healthy, but I'm past that, I'm far past that. I eat four, even five eggs sometimes. I love egg yolk. I could live off of eggs. Hard boiled, scrambled, omelets, egg muffins, you name it, I'll eat it. Collagen. I've been putting collagen in our oatmeal, in our yogurt, in our hot cocoa, literally in anything I can think of, I'll put our extra collagen in it. I use the Perfect Supplements Collagen. It's one of the best, purest forms of collagen. I've tried so many brands. This is by far my favorite. I also make gelatin gummies and I've made them so many times on this channel. And I try to snack on that while I'm making breakfast. Again, this may seem like an overkill, but I feel better throughout the entire day if I really focus on protein in the mornings. The next tip I have, I'm sorry, it's so annoying to hear this over and over, but it is the most powerful thing in my day that shifts me from a bad negative day to a good and positive day, and it's to get outside and to move outside. My reasonings for moving and getting outside are not for any type of exercise or workout, it's more for your mental health. It's to feel refreshed, to take yourself out of the situation, out of the space that you've been in all day, to expose your eyes to the light, and that actually helps you sleep better at night. There are so many more deeper, holistic benefits to moving and being outside. 
So it's the middle of winter. I'm not a fan of cold, but I'm trying my hardest to still get outside and it really does make a difference. Number four has to do with this little device right here. This is called the Sensate. It's an infrasound resonance device that when you pair it with sessions on their app, it works to reduce stress and improve overall well-being. Okay, I know that was a mouthful. Let me just show you how I use it and tell you my experience with it. So I take it off its lanyard. I just keep it here so that I don't lose it. I lay down and I place it on my chest. I put headphones in my ear that are connected to the Sensate app. And then I just do a short little 10 minute session. What you will feel here is a little resonance, almost like a vibration, but it's controlled and it's like in a sequence. So it has the ability to help tone your vagal nerve, which is just the queen of all the stress response, nerve responses in your whole body. A toned vagus nerve is a calm body. So this just supports that. And what I do is I sit down for 10 minutes. I just lay down on my bed. It's nice that I have my headphones in because I'm not distracted. And I do this before the worst slash hardest times of my day, which is like between four and six. We're making dinner. We've had a long day. The kids just have crazy energy at that time of day. And so before I lose it, I do a little bit of this just to like breathe de-stress and prepare myself for the rest of the night. I did team up with this company and if you guys are interested, there is a $30 discount code for you guys. You guys know me. I'm not someone who says you have to buy this and you need this to make your life better, but it really has supported me and just given me this tiny little escape for 10 minutes and it's really helped. Tate does it too, by the way. He actually really enjoys it. We just went through a massive transition in our family and this thing was used a lot. <laughs> Last tip I have for you guys is all about sleep. It's actually a few things that are gonna help you get ready for sleep and to have very deep and restful sleep so that your following day can be better a little bit better, a little bit more focused, a little bit more in the right direction. I just know that when I don't sleep well, my day, my patience, everything is just harder. Okay, so here are three little things that really help not only myself, but my husband and my children all sleep a little bit better and wake up with more energy and focus. Number one, we dim the lights at night. So right after dinner, it's dim the lights, bathe, get dressed, brush teeth, read some books, get in bed. We have candles, we have red lights, but most importantly, we're getting those fluorescent lights out of the picture so that our body can start producing the melatonin. Number two, and we started doing this maybe a year and a half ago, and it just makes the biggest change in our mental health, <laughs> in our mental states, and kind of supporting the, okay, time to shut down process. Number two is Organic Olivia's sleep juice. I'm not a doctor. I will never claim to be a doctor. I'm just a mom who researches and gets things that fix problems, okay? So this stuff fixes problems. I wasn't sleeping well, my kids weren't sleeping well, and right after dinner, I would give them a dropper of this and they would calm down. And then I would give them a little bit more right before bed, they would sleep and it would be wonderful and it helps Tate and I sleep too. And it's 100% organic herbs, which just is so nice. It's not adding chemicals or random natural flavored gummies, anything like that. It's just, it's pure and it's beneficial to the body and to help support your sleep. And then here's the other product that is new to our family within the last few months. I didn't share it with you guys for a while because I just wanted to make sure that it does what it says it does and it did. <laughs> And I was like, let me just test out the waters. There's no way this stuff is this good, but it is. It's called Goodnight Lotion by Earthly Wellness and it has some magnesium in it. And you put it on your belly and on your legs and your body absorbs it because your body absorbs 60% of what you put on it. And not only does it help us all sleep so much deeper, like I'm not waking up as much as I used to. I'm actually sleeping through the night in a stage of life that was very stressful for me. So mind blown great products that are pure, they're clean, and they help me sleep better and my children and my husband so that we can all have better days the next day. So I hope these things help you guys. Sleep is so important and you guys have spoken loudly about me sharing some sleep stuff. I'll continue to do that, um, but those are my main three. So thank you for watching this video. I hope you got some 
good tips out of it. Take one or two. There's no pressure ever. Just take what works for you. And I'll see you guys in my next video.